I'm a chemical engineer. I uh, worked in Hamilton for 25 years with a chemical company. And then I went into consulting. I did consulting for a couple of years. And I got invited to go to Saudi Arabia. And uh, I had a great time there for five and a half years. Uh, this sand is uh, from the Rubal Kali. It's from a sand dune. Big, big, beautiful sand dune. And this is just a layer that was on the top. As soon as you disturbed it, underneath it was not red, like ordinary sand. The light affects it. And uh, uh, so uh, we gathered it, and as you see, it's retained its color for years and years and years and years. We flew around the world three times. I went all over. It was wonderful. I was born in Winnipeg. I knew Winnipeg very well. My aunt said, now she said, if you get any leave, she said, you come and stay with us. She said, I know some young ladies. She said, I can get your date. I know a young blonde lady. I said, I've been having terrible luck with blondes. So she said, well, there's a redhead. I said, well, let's try the redhead. She phoned the redhead and the redhead was out. So she phoned the, blonde, the brunette and I married her. My wife, uh, uh, we've been married 65 years. Uh, we have two children. I have a son uh, and a daughter. I'm pretty happy because we still have some contacts outside of the residence. I have, I'm a member of Probus and I started a lunch club with a friend about 10 years ago and we meet once a month. And all these guys get together. We call them Romeos, retired old men 80 out. How would people describe me? A good-natured old fella. <laughs> Always sort of had a positive outlook on life. But I do think that uh, uh, when you get to this age, you have uh, so much experience, so much has happened, that uh, you really could make some contributions beyond what you do.